And finally, our most popular comment of the day today, it's from 163.com, and it's the word shameless. Well, this uh, one-word response uh, to a critical report carried in the Beijing Times, uh, that was about the heavy-handed PR tactics of one local government. The paper says that residents of Xiaoyang, uh, that's a city in Hunan province, are being paid to praise the city fathers when they get a survey call from the provincial government, that's a higher level government. The report says city residents received the following text message from the city's social management office. It says, only when people in Xiaoyang say nice things about the city can the city really be good. Please give objective, positive comments when you receive calls from the provincial government. And then comes the money line. You will be eligible for a 300 yuan, that's around $50, subsidy for doing so if you bring a phone record to this office which shows a five minute long phone call was recorded with the provincial office. Uh, the paper also quotes locals who allege the same information was passed on to them by community staff during door-to-door -door visits. Reporters from China National Radio later reached Guiyang officials who admitted the messages were uh, sent. However, a spokesperson said the aim was simply to motivate citizens to answer the calls and to cooperate with the provincial government's survey. This uh, poster and more than 9,000 others seem to feel that, that statement might be described as uh, frugal with the truth. And those are just some of the comments making waves here in China these days. Coming up next on China Take, Britain plans to ban the import of traditional Chinese patent medicines from next year.